Hello everybody and welcome back to the new save file once again we are jumping in for another win on the win streak let's hope at least um who do I want to play as here what tainted characters do we have that we haven't really played a whole heck of a lot of we haven't done Judas in a while of course I've still got tainted Kane to play I eh. Um, although, what have we done as Eden? Let's do an Eden run. I do love Eden. We've not done tons as him. We could do Dark Path, could do Mother, could do Mega Satan. We've got Boss Rush. Um, Eden's one of my favourite characters in the game, so it's always, uh, there's never a dull moment as him, unless you get a really dull start, which <laughs> you never know. It could happen. Unfortunately, I'm slightly impaired in my ability to play Isaac today because I've cut my finger, and it's the finger that I use on my up arrow, so we'll, we'll see how I do. I've got a plaster on at the minute. It wasn't, it wasn't a super deep cut. I was chopping some lettuce, and I, uh, I cut it. Right, we've got, um... Something one trinket upon entering a new floor. Rerolls any trinket on you, smelted or not upon use. Drop. I'm gonna say it's, gonna say it's drops one trinket upon entering a new floor. Kind of interesting. Um. Oh for fuck. Go away. Eternal D10. Is there any way that I can outright remove an item from the game? Just just get rid of it forever. Cause this item will not leave me alone. <laughs> Anyways, we also got Acid Baby, which is kind of actually interesting, uh, interesting grab early on. Oh, that's a very bad hit. I'm probably going to lose this black heart here, but eh, we only just got it. Uh, I am playing with a, not really a new mod, but an updated version of a mod that I've had on for a while. I have a Resprite mod on. It's called, like, Shauna's Resprite or something like that. I don't remember the exact name of the mod now. But anyways, it gets updated pretty regularly, and uh, I... Um, I had a really old version locally because um, I had like a, a resprite pack, which means it doesn't get updated automatically. So there's a bunch of new stuff. As you, as you can see, like keys have been resprite and stuff. So I've basically just installed pretty much everything apart from the fires uh, that we had issues with last time. Um, and I'm just going to see what you guys think. If there's any specific sprite you see that you really aren't a fan of, let me know in the comments and I can remove those ones specifically. But they recently updated to like resprite all the bosses and stuff. And like I said, there's keys. Pennies have been slightly changed, stuff like that. So I just wanted to have an all encompassing version of this. Oh, this isn't going to be good. That was okay, actually. Um, yeah, so unfortunately, not a great first floor um, that we got here. Because unfortunately. We have uh, missed out on an item because not only was it an active, but it was an active that even if I had no active, I wouldn't take because of how much it annoys me. Dude, can you stop spawning things? Wow, we this is intense. I want to get you because you can actually shoot me. You spawned a lot of dippies. I mean, we've started off with reasonably good stats here. We've uh, got high fire rate, low damage, which I actually prefer to high damage, low fire rate. So I don't mind that too much. Uh, we started with better than average speed, uh, pretty good range. All in all, not a bad start. And yeah, I'll try and remember to utilize Acid Baby. It's one of those babies that you don't really remember you have and therefore don't take full advantage of. Because um, I think it does drop you some pills every now and again, but also obviously it makes regular pills do that poison effect. Um, so I want to be trying to utilize the poison effect when I can. So, this is probably going to be a more pill-centric run than I'd normally uh, go for. There's a pill right there. Uh, what card do we start off with? Okay, now that is a sprite I do not like. Um, why is my card all stretched out like that? So, that's one I will be replacing. In fact, one second. Okay, that one's been sorted for the next episode already. we we'll start off with breakfast here and that. We've got a devil card here, but I'd rather take the pill, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah, that card looks weird. Anyways, let's just hop down to the next floor. Um... I guess we could do Mother here, so let's take the Mother route at least. Uh, a little bit of a shame with this active that it doesn't give you a trinket to start with, but it apparently does give us one at the start of the next floor, so we're going to get one here. Um, or not. Is that not what it said it did? Gulps one trinket upon entering. Okay, I thought it said drops. Okay, okay, that's actually pretty decent. I don't mind that. we got lemon juice here and the poison, of course, and then there's another pill right there. Indeedly deed. Now, PhD along with this would be real nice. Um, but yeah, it's, it's pretty good for smelting trinkets, if we can get them, that is. Uh, we'll, we'll see if that ends up being the case. Oh, I kind of like that guy's little belt she did there. But yeah, since we're respriting a lot of stuff here, there's, gonna, there's bound to be ones that we're not a big fan of. Um, these big 
sweeping respray mods, I kind of like that. It's kind of, it's why I like to be able to pick and choose what I want from the packs. Um, so we'll do exactly that. We'll do exactly that. We'll pick and choose what we want. As for the question of the day to day. Hmm. Hmm. What's one overpowered item from another roguelike you'd really like to see in the Binding of Isaac? Like, I'd... I, I was gonna say I'd love to see Clone, but that basically already exists in the Arky. Um... <laughs> I don't know, there's, 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 there's quite a few. There's, there's definitely quite a few. Gungeon's definitely my sort of go-to game, um, for looking at stuff like that. But there's plenty of others as well. Anything that's multi-shot is always fun. It's difficult to say, to be honest. I, I, I've pr proposed the question, and I don't even know my own answer to it. Also, this guy will not die. Holy, I mean, thank you. Also, not a big fan of that bomb respray either, I'll be honest. But we got a secret room here. I like that. The key one, I, I, I don't mind so much. What does this guy do on a rainbow poop? Okay. Um, take that. Yeah, one sec. Right, I've started the bomb one as well. That one's... I kind of like the vanilla one more. Um, I won't use my pill in this room here because we've got a big room coming up. Oh, what have I done? Oh, no, I'm okay. That was close. Hey, you've got another pill there as well. Beautiful. Tears down. Unfortunately, such is the way. We're going to be using pills for damage, but... Of course, sometimes that isn't going to work particularly well in our favour now, is it? It's not going to work particularly well in our favour. Whatever happened to the um, the end to the Gungeon mod for the Binding of Isaac? I don't know how many of you saw, but um, prior to Repentance coming out, th th this game had a reasonably robust, robust modding scene, and one of the um, one of the mods was um, a full-on like resprite of the game to make it into Enter the Gungeon. Um, and yeah, that never never kind of made its way back into the game, did it? Ooh, new chest respray. I kind of like that chest respray, I'll be honest. Um, and then we can... Yeah, I'll take Randy the Snail. And I'll pop this as well. Black art, not bad. One sec. Right, sorry about that. Let's continue on. We've got our snail buddy. Good to go. So I think my active is going to gulp on the next floor or re-roll when I use it. So... I can basically use it, like, as an active that I don't use, essentially. Like, I can just keep keep it as in, in my active slot and never use it to just keep gulping trinkets per floor, I guess. Um, and then, um, if I want to, I can then re-roll them. But I, honestly, I don't think I'm going to want to re-roll them. Speed up, not bad. Oh, that was a really bad hit by me there. I just kind of walked into that guy. Try and get my snail in there where I can. It's not exactly the easiest to hit with, but... We will try when we can. There you go. You can kind of do, like, ricochets as well, where... There you go. Where, like, because it's already bouncing, you can keep hitting it a few times over and over. Any multi-shot or tears up will help us hit it more. Well, at least we started with decent tears, and the tears uh, down wasn't too bad. So annoying, though, regardless. Magic 8 ball is fine. The fool card, I guess I'll grab. Um, ooh, okay, this is a pretty good devil deal here. I think I'll take the goat head and the deviled egg here. Um, yeah, goat head's pretty good stuff. Right, let's carry on going down. I do liketh the goat head. Um, and yeah, I'll go in here and fool card out. This isn't too hard. Awas is Awas is better to, to, to get out of this room with so that we can get a crawl space. Worth it to get a potential item. It's not a great item, I'll be honest. Um how exactly are we doing this? Okay, so this is just a Oh, this is an interesting room actually. Uh -huh. Oh, I like this, I like this. Kind of the challenge here is to try and fall all the way down without hitting the mushrooms. 
There you go. That's a, that's a cool room. I like it. Not a great item to grab, I'll be honest, but not awful either. Not awful either. All right, we don't have any pills at the minute, but we are going to be getting a pair of rooms, so don't worry about that. Uh, try and take out some of you via the fires here. There you go. The penny respray is, isn't bad either. I don't mind that. Oh, God. I don't like rooms with these guys where I don't have fires to rely on, because... I feel I can get hit. Ooh, damn. Okay, we got a half that's uh, a champion. Will he be a champion throughout the rooms? I would hope so, but I don't actually know. Uh, I've got enough money to maybe buy something from here. Perky Go and Humbling Bundle would be fantastic. I'd even probably bomb my donation machine for that if given the opportunity, to be honest. Really, really good. And yeah, he does stay as a champion. Nice. Makes him rather darn useful. Um... I'm not quite sure what happened there. I got... Maybe it's because I deleted it in the files while I'm playing. I see you under there, boys. Oh, dude. Getting hit way more than I should be right now. I deleted the bomb sprite and I think it's... The game's gotten a bit confused. Now bombs just drop as a little shadow and nothing else. Whoops, I guess. I don't know why cards are still spawning as normal then, though. Maybe I didn't fully remove the cards right. I don't know. Right, try and make our way over here. Uh, our snail's all the way in the back over here. I don't know how he got over there, but he's doing a great job. And then rocket in a jar. Not really my, my thing. Strange Attractor. Reasonably annoying, but not terrible. I actually do think it can work quite well in certain runs. It really does depend on the run itself, The Balls of Steel is awesome. Okay, doing pretty well on the pill front so far. Only one really bad pill thus far. I think that's a reasonably good track record. Um, let's try and bomb here. So bombs show up normally like that, though. Confusing. Um, we'll certainly take this. We can bomb into here as well. Ah! You guys almost fell directly onto me, and I will definitely take Wire Coat Hanger to get our fire rate back up to a reasonable level. Up to 420 exactly. Amazing. Yeah, um, got, got a decent day plan today as well. Uh, going over to a, a friend's house that we haven't seen in a, a little while, and they're going to be making us some food. It's pretty exciting stuff, and then next weekend, um, going to be sort of hosting a dinner party kind of thing. I wouldn't really call it a dinner party, but I'm going to be making some smash burgers, like homemade buns and stuff. I'm, I'm kind of excited for it. Last time I made them, they turned out really, really, really well. Really enjoyed them. So, um, gonna be, people have requested them again since. I quite like cooking for a group of people. It's definitely a little bit stressful. And then also at the same time, you're kind of stuck in the kitchen um, for a good portion of the night. But I don't really mind it. And we've got like an open an open, like, kitchen into living room in our flat, so it's not like I miss out on the conversation. I can still hear people and stuff, and I can still, like, talk back and forth. It's just like when you're actually making the burgers, like, actively at the, uh, at the pan. You can't really take too much focus away from it because there's a lot going on, and you've got to kind of careful around timings and stuff, but regardless, like, I quite enjoy cooking, so it's not a, a real bother to me. Okay. Nice and easy kills on these guys. Nice and easy. Good stuff. Not great. And then, yeah, let's go buy Humbling Bundle. Because that is back in incredible with the mods that we have on. Because it can double Soul Hearts and Black Hearts. Yeah, look, this bomb here is just invisible. Um, I'll, I'll see if that persists into the next run I do when I've, like, rebooted the game. Um, but we'll see. In fact, what I could do now is actually... One sec. Yeah, let, 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 me, let me try rebooting the game. One sec. So, we're back in business, but the game spawned me directly on top of this white fire. So, that's fun. <laughs> Thanks, game. Thanks for that. Uh, so, I guess I'm doing my mirror room now because, yeah, the game has decided it. So, it just spawned me back in directly on top of it. Luckily, the mirror room here isn't too difficult because it's very, very close. But, yeah, it should be fixed. I think the one thing that might not be is when I drop my own bombs. I might have to still, still do something with that. Um, but pickups on the ground should all be fixed now, including the cards. That was close. Okay, one of these big guys being a champion is not great. 
not ideal. Randy, get him. Get him, Randy. Thank you. And yeah, we can just grab that. I could go do my boss again, but I'm not going to take that risk right now. Yeah, it just spawned me back in right on top of the white fire. It's like, if I didn't have the holy mantle, oh boy, that would have been a very frustrating death to have received. Pretty much no way to avoid it in that case. But yeah, we've got Humbling Bundle now in a really good spot because it can double black hearts and soul hearts. Very, very happy about that. Oh god, I did not expect you to jump up there. Wow, I just took a lot of damage I had no reason in taking. Very bad, very bad. I did just use a bomb there, which is maybe a mistake. Yeah. We did get the locked memories, which is kind of interesting. We'll uh, we'll try and work that out on this floor. Uh, right. So we, we've got some good stuff here. We've got some good stuff. Prank cookie, of course, is great. Veil of Darkness is interesting. I think I'm going to take both these, this and this. Veil of Darkness. Did Veil of Darkness give us anything there? I don't think it worked. It's supposed to give me an item. It seems that the curse collection is just completely broken right now. I have notified the developer, but they said that it's something that they can't help. Like, it's not, it's not something that they've caused. Um, so it's a bit concerning, because one of the mods that I have is uh, messing with it, and I, I I don't, I'll be honest, I don't really know how to fix that. Um, so that is a bit concerning. Hey, you found it straight away. That is awesome. So yeah, I think Veil of Darkness there was a complete whiff. I don't think it did anything for us. I think, I don't, yeah, it didn't even increase our damage. Like, wait a minute, let, let me find out what Veil of Darkness is meant to do. Um, cursed. It's in the Cursed Collection, I believe. Cursed Collection. Um, where are you, Veil of Darkness? Veil of Darkness. Grants Curse of Blight, three hearts, 1.5 damage, and grants one of the following items. Yeah, so it didn't do any of that. Uh, it, it didn't give us the curse. Um, that's really frustrating. Uh, that's pretty good, though. I like that. Yeah, so unfortunately, the Cursed Collection right now is uh, not in a good spot for us. Not in a good spot for us, because we can't really take anything from that collection and it work correctly. But at the same time, I also have absolutely no inkling into what mod could be breaking it. Uh, which is very, very frustrating. So if anyone, if anyone is getting the same issue, let me know so I can try and fix it. Because... Yeah, take an item like the Veil of Darkness, which is normally a really good item, and having it do absolutely nothing. Little bit of a bummer. Um, we'll take another key here, and we are going to have to try and get in here on the next floor to do Mother uh, by getting two bombs this floor. We'll see if that comes to fruition. We'll just have to gamble it. I mean, there you go. Done. <laughs> that worked out pretty well, to be honest. It just gave us it straight away. Straight away. Frank Cookie's doing some good work though. All these random extra tier effects I like. Not exactly sure where I'm going to use my final crack key here. I haven't really got a good spot in mind for it. Got that guy. Some of the pills. That's reduced tier size though. I really don't want to pop too many reduced tier size pills. I'm getting a lot of those right now. I don't think it's a good idea to use all of them every single time I see them. Tier size isn't that important, but it's it's not a great idea to reduce it on purpose for for one room of poison damage as well. So many red heart drops. What the hell's all this about? Still no red room here. Okay, bombs are back to normal now. Good, good. Good, good, good. I like the chest tree sprites. I don't know, what do people think of the chests? They're a little bit, like, too sort of high res for Isaac. I don't know, high res isn't really the word. 
But I still think they look pretty decent. If, if uh, But please, again, do let me know. I really would like you guys to be able to look at something that you like the look of, not just the things that I like the look of. So I don't mind the vanilla ones either. Um, I could gamble with one of these rooms. Do you know what? That's not that bad. Out, out of all the things we could have gotten, mainly a combat room with nothing else, that's a pretty, pretty good grab. Unfortunately, we managed to get a trinket that last floor. So our active didn't do much for us. At the minute, I really don't want to re-roll the, uh, the trinket that we currently have smelted, because it's pretty good. Oh, that was a really bad hit, though. There's that double soul heart drop. That's what we like to see, baby. That's what we like to see. Okay. A little bit more money here. I was really hoping to actually utilize a shop here, but it's not all sunshine and roses for us this time around. God, so many hearts. Oh, right. Sorry about that. Uh... Secret room? Okay, so yeah, the bombs that I drop are still incorrect. I can I can certainly fix those eventually though. Get one of these guys as a friend, why not? Do you know what? That's a pretty good job. I don't know how long he's gonna last, I'll be honest. But for right now, he's kind of performing pretty well. Little ninja boy. Little ninja boy. Still got our item room to find here. My coins, boy. Oh, God, no, Randy. No. He's stuck in there. Oh, my God, no. Look at this. Randy's going crazy. Randy went off there. Wow. He got, like, stuck in there and, like, became, like, a perpetual motion machine. Uh, we got double void bombs here if we want them. Um, I think I do. Oh, really? It splits them? That's, that's rude as fuck. I'm going to take one of them. Splits them both into three heart costs. Very rude. We've got a pill here. We should probably grab. Right, I'm just... I'm, I'm taking risks with my health because we're, we're pretty guaranteed to get a lot of health coming our way. Yes. That's the good stuff right there. Such a gigantic damage up from that. Um, we did get our two bombs. Grab that. And we'll be on our way down to the mines now. Yeah, these void bombs. Not great when you have super low bombs, but if we manage to get to mother with like 15 or so bombs, they can really put in some work. So I quite like them. Um, trying to find the best room to use my pill in. It ain't this one. Health up. Beautiful. Wasn't expecting that. Uh, it's interesting that the health up takes the red heart out of my, um, out of my burn heart and puts it in there. Dog tooth is probably pretty worth it, to be honest. Do you know what? I'm going to reduce tier size here. I don't care. My tears are already so small. Who cares? I wanted to kill that room a little bit faster. I'm hoping I don't lose my burn heart here, but I'm having a feeling. I'm having a feeling that I'm probably going to end up losing it. Just because of the circumstances. I've not been able to fill it quickly here. Oh, we got a secret room here, apparently. Um, just let me check something. I know it's to the left. I hear you, I hear you. There is a red heart just here. Thank you. It doesn't fully fill it, but it does something for us. <clears throat> I love the way that Randy, he finally gets settled. And I'm like, ka -chow. Launch him into the stratosphere. God damn, my nerve. I need to sneeze so bad, but it's just not coming. I'm going to have to pause when, I, when it comes, but it's on the verge right now. It's very frustrating. But yeah, Dogtooth, pretty good if he can recognize the noises. Definitely need some more damage up. I mean, we've got heal spare, which obviously does augment our damage quite a bit. 
Really again? Come on now, game. Bit fucking rude, wouldn't you say? Bit fucking rude. Twice in a row. Now, also, how do we have another lemon juice pill? Why are the only pills I find tier size downs? What is this? I'm just gonna keep taking them at this point. Make my tiers as small as humanly possible. I will not quit until my tiers are non-existent. At least we've got spectral here for those guys. Whoa, what are these dudes? Are they gonna birth into enemies? What, what are they? Oh, they just, they just create fire by the looks of it. Seems like they just create fire. Ooh, hello. Hello, good sir. For some reason I was not expecting you. Don't have to worry too much about the friends you spawn along the way. It's more so when you die that we have to start worrying. Beautiful damage there. Wow, good hit. Oh, we've got a void portal. He's... Dude, this absolute Chad just gigabombed me. And the knockback from the gigabomb knocks me into a fire. That's a pro player right there. This fire's about... I'm taking so much unnecessary damage right now. These are the guys we've got to worry about. So many of them. Get the water tumors. We do now have another devil deal that I don't know if I can afford. I could just take the respawn, but I'm not going to do it. This is Mausoleum already? Fuck. The Gamble of a Century. We already do a Mines Floor. What was the last Mines Floor we did? Oh no, it's because we skipped. I see, I see. Okay, it doesn't matter. Right. I've taken a massive gamble here. An absolutely massive gamble. But I'm hoping that my hubris pays off. Bombs of Key is actually pretty good here. I need a hero. I need something that's really going to send us into the stratosphere. Honestly, the guys that we have so far are friends. We got some pretty good ones. We got some pretty good pals. Got a fire spewer. Got a purple buddy. We got a um, little wiki tongue boy. All sorts of goodness. Secret room is likely to be here. There you go. What the hell? There's a bunch of buddies. Oh, also, double black heart. It all worked out, see? We got one of these fortune machines. Finally got a shop we can use. Probably just take this. Let's just donate a ton. Haven't done it in a while. It'll probably jam. Why did it slow down? Damn. It's letting us donate a lot right now. Holy hell, okay. No jam. No jam. Very nice. I like that a lot. Proptosis, finally a proper damage increase. I absolutely love Proptosis as well. Right. Tears down pill. No thank you. It's the the buddies that we've got, along with Randy, they're really causing some real real ruckus right now. There's there's quite a lot of noise going on with these guys. They're really making themselves known. But yeah, now with um with Proptosis, we can do some real damage. Our tiny, tiny tears do make it a little confusing, I'll be honest. Ow. Bad hit. Health up. Hell yes. We're getting lucky with the health ups. Honestly, consumables are so good as well right now. Humbling bundle is just insanely good. The, the split buddies, the little purple guys... They're doing great. They've like survived so long and they just keep splitting. I can't tell if it's like Randy doing most of this work as well. <laughs> it's very confusing. Ow. I got whipped. Right, straight to the boss. Oh, Wopsin, hello. 
Honestly, we have so many bombs now. Let's get one of them in there. Oh, God. I do not like the prospect of this. Beautiful bomb there. I think he gets, like, damage protection when he gets to a phase where he's going to spawn on a new enemy. Yeah. Look at that damage. Oh, get up close and personal. Why has he got the rage on him? I don't want him to have rage. He's just surviving way longer than he should. That rage thing. He's not a fan of that at all. There you go. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. You have been the one. You have been the one for me. At this point, it's probably just worth taking Krampus's head. Like, this active has just not been very good for us, because unfortunately, we've been very light on our trinkets this run. Like, very, very light, so... It's not really showing its true worth. It's a very cool idea for an active, but it kind of requires some level of uh, luck with trinkets, because it doesn't increase the amount you get at all. Another health up. Bad. Remember, everything's got the chance to rebirth at the minute. Certainly spell trouble if we're not careful enough. One sec. I swear to God, I keep pausing to sneeze, and it just, it just, the moment I pause, it's like, bye. No sneeze anymore. Bye. Good stuff. Still need a little bit more HP here. The goats ain't too bad. Gotta remember I have Proptosis. Because my tears are so small, it's hard to remember I have Proptosis. Especially considering they don't seem to disappear very quickly. Um, so I need to get really close to enemies to do maximum damage. Black Lantern gives us a black heart, so I'm going to take it. We've got Curse of Master at the minute. Don't know what that is. Ooh, we've got some rainbows going on with uh, Frank Cookie there. Yeah, that's pretty good. The pepper would have also been pretty good. Yeah, maybe? No, here? Oh, surprising. Did not expect that. Speed down, lovely. Balls of steel and a bad guess. While held counts as one item towards the bookworm, transform uh, bookworm transformation. Eh. Not great. That chest lied to me. It had different contents than it's advertised. Enemy with a 33% chance to spawn a red candle fire upon kill. That's really good. I'll take that. Okay, health is in a way better spot now. Way, way better. And we are on to our boss. Got a little bit of extra use out of Krampus's head there. I don't know if Krampus's head benefits from my items like Proptosis. I would imagine so, to be honest. We do have boss rush here, which we haven't done. Is it 25 minutes for boss rush here? Because otherwise I have to enter now, don't I? I'm, I'm going to have to miss out my devil deal here. Actually, no, I'm not because I've got, uh, what's it called? You know what I mean? Lead Pencil is probably my number one choice right now. Yep. Let's take Lead Pencil. Right, let's get Boss Rush done. Good that we have an active that works well for Boss Rush as well. Yeah. Oh, what the hell? Little fly boy. Yeah. Any enemy that's really difficult, just like, hug them with our face. And they'll die very quickly. Got to remember we have Spectral as well here. That helps a lot. Picked up something there. I have no idea what. Beautiful. If we get a lead pencil in there as well, it's game over for him. Game over, man. Also, yeah, I'm liking these fires. These fires are uh, helping out quite a lot. The red candle fires. Oh, 
Hello, bat. Goodbye, bat. Didn't kill either. It's kind of not even quicker to use Krampus's head at this point by the looks of things. But what the? What's firing Brimstone? Oh, uh, one of these guys that's mine, apparently. Would not have expected that. Would not have expected that at all. Yeah, honestly, Krampus's head just might not even be worth using. It takes so long to use, and I do so much more damage with my tears. There you go. God damn, we'll kill yourself before they even get to fire. Aw, oh, bugger. I forgot about the baby spewing out tears. Which probably only like three or four rounds off of finishing this all. health up as well. We're getting really good pills here. Acid Baby's kind of been amazing so far. Really done us a very, very good job. Yeah. There you go. Undefined. Get out of here. Make sure to go to the Devil Deal. That's very good. We'll take that. Yeah, like that's just not a lot of damage, is it? This, however, I'm just gonna sit here and take the damage. Not gonna be a lot. Beautiful stuff. Right, away we go. Okay, so far, pretty successful, I think. Pretty successful. I think we've managed to claw our way back from a, a reasonably bad situation. Wow. Okay, these are all fading. Five rotten hearts, yeah, let's take that. It's very risky, but I think the flies could be super, super useful. So I was hoping for a double soul heart. Faded Polaroid. Still no missing poster. I just want to unlock the lost man. We need some, some way of generating a lot of trinkets. That's the only way we're going to do it. Get like mum's box or something. Secret room here. Oh, they give us a morbid heart. That's a really cool idea. Grants you a morbid heart for 25. Very good use of our money there. We got two morbid hearts out of that room. Why is it everything disappearing so quick? It must be something to do with my curse. Curse of the swine. Maybe I get more drops, but the old fade. Because it says that my curses should have, like, positives and negatives with uh, the black... Is it Black Lantern it's called? Not Black Candle? This rock looks really cool. Is this something I can blow up? Nope, it just looks really cool. <laughs> Pressing forward. We got a few more trinkets here, but we don't need them anymore. Don't need those keys either. Don't know what that jumpy jumpy out the groundy guy was looking to do. Ooh, speed up, yes please. Should have waited until I was in a room to use that really. Especially knowing what it was. Oh, this is a uh, this is one of the modded pull-up things, isn't it? And wow, what a reward. I don't think I'll be taking that, thank you. <laughs> what a reward. We did get all the flies out of that though. That, and we actually got a thingy heart as well. I can't remember that, what they're called now. The ones that give us the, the flies each floor, but we keep it. The Apollyon one. Whale boy is here again. What are you doing, whale? 
Are you able to die for me? That you are, my son, that you are. I'm trying to keep it alive if I can. Empress is good for the boss. I'd like to guarantee me getting one of these uh, wispy dot sort of dudes. What exactly is going on with this guy? Do I bother with him? Okay, no, he's he's killable now. I should indeed bother. It's getting confusing. There's so many like bits of creep and stuff everywhere. Oh god. There's worms everywhere. At least the fires kind of have that knock-on effect. There you go. I finally sneezed. My god. That was satisfying. Been waiting for that my whole life. What do I do with these again? Do I just shoot them? Maybe I had to get that guy to throw them at me. Whoopsie. Okay, good shit. Mr. Dead. Gotta love Mr. Dead. And he is indeed Mr. Dead. Wow, it was a very quick kill. Got another morbid heart here. Wow. That's lucky. And a black heart to end off this floor. We've got... Is that a golden key? What's going on there? I'm confused by this. It's like... It's a golden key, but it's not a golden key. It's not the golden key we normally know to be a golden key. It's a golden key. I know I lost my thingy to, to check that, but I had to. It was worthless. It didn't do anything. But it's a golden key. <clears throat> I'm confused by that. Maybe there's a new golden pickups or something? Cares for the scythe. I don't know what cares for the scythe is meant to be. More HP up. There's so many morbid hearts right now. It's a lot of extra survivability on these floors. A lot. Still want to take the Empress here. Right, let's hope we can not go too many wrong ways. It would be rather nice if we can just kind of make a straight shot for Mother herself. And I say that, of course, the game does what it does best and trolls me. Ooh. Whoa, that laser sound is interesting. <laughs> plus 10 bombs actually isn't bad. I don't mind that at all. Plus 10 bombs is, is plus 10 bombs to throw at Mother with uh, Void Bombs coming into play. And especially considering the Void Bombs kind of suck enemies in too. Pretty good stuff. Still more wrong ways though. It's got to be the wrong way. As long as we're getting rooms where they don't, where it's not enemies that spawn more enemies, I'm pretty happy, I'll be honest. Ooh, the red chests look really cool. The laser guy is popping off, man. Really going crazy. No, thank you. That room is a bit too dangerous for my liking. Secret room. Nothing to really go for here. We should be pretty much on the boss now. I'd say a few rooms away at max. Got another bark bark here. Probably at the very end, right? No. I'm guessing here then? No. Here? I don't know, and I'm not going to bother finding out, because we are at the boss. Okay, we managed to keep a lot of our health going into this. 
We've got a lot of bombs to go out to. Pop the Empress when we get down there. Pop our Active. Hopefully my Viz doesn't die too instantly. He's dead. <laughs> oh, Randy kind of... Whoa, Randy's getting in there. Not quite sure what Randy did there, but keep it up. Need to, like, get him wedged underneath that armpit. I've never seen that happen before. I managed to block that ball with a bomb. Okay, good stuff. Good start. I don't like that little butthole part of her being pink. That looks very wrong. I'm not going to worry too much about taking damage here because we have a lot of hits available to us. I'm going to be dropping bombs down wherever I can. I'm pushing them straight into her. Even if they don't hit her, the um, ring will. Beautiful. All the bombs did very well there. Either way, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this run. Definitely a pretty good one. And yeah, another one to the win streak. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.